today was a day of relaxing here in Lakeland, Florida. First time I came here was in 2008 during the outpouring. You might say whatever you want about what happened here, but I know that God was here then and uh, that's when I met a lot of wonderful people. For example, I met uh, Eduardo Juarez who lives here in Lakeland. He has an awesome testimony and today I hooked up with Eduardo again, but before that, God blessed me with a cup of Starbucks coffee. It's on me today. Is it? It is. It is on me today. Why? Because you had to stay here for so long waiting on a cup of coffee. Oh, thank you and God bless you. You have a wonderful day. Made, made my day. Come back and see us. That's all we have. You made my day. I had a bad day yesterday. Now I got a free cup of coffee. There you go. Thank you very much. Have a good right. one. Thank you. I had a flat tire on the rental car so they replaced it and I went to see Eduardo in his home and uh, we had a great night of fellowship and uh, I did an interview with him for life in him and uh, after that we went out for a wonderful meal. It was another wonderful day given to us by God's amazing grace. Life in him, life in him. My name is Eduardo Juarez. I live in, uh, currently live in Lakeland, Florida. I knew God all my life. I just didn't, uh, I never really knew him. I had head knowledge of him, but I never really let him in those places in my life. Uh, uh, our daughters actually come to know God first. To me, a man's man now is someone uh, like you, Pontus, uh, someone like, uh, a brother Jason Lee Jones or Todd White or Georgian Banoff who is willing to cry and to reach out for the lost. I don't want a rock to outcry me. Even though I feel like a rock sometimes, I don't want a rock to outcry me. You know, I, I, want, I want God to, you know, when he looks to and fro on the earth every day, he'll stop because he hears Eduardo in Lakeland, Florida saying, oh God, I love you.